Hello everyone. How are you all? I hope everyone is fine and doing great. Today I am here to discuss about a revised study material which has been issued by ICI for May 2022 and onward exam. Of course with this revised study material there are two questions in the mind of student. So what are the amendment applicable and what are the new questions added by issue added by institute for May 2022 and onward exam. Let me clarify first that this video is not applicable to those students who are writing the examination for November 2021 attempt which is going to be held in December 2021. Now coming to the amendment. What are the amendments which will be applicable for May 2022 and onward exam? So there are two major amendments. So of course these two major amendments which we need to now go through. Correct now means if you have already taken coaching class. So you need to have an idea about two major amendments. But what I want to say that these two major amendments which, which will not affect the entire syllabus. Means it will affect only some chapter. So don't worry about this amendment. This amendment you can read additionally and then incorporate wherever it is required. Understood? So what are the two major amendments that we need to understand? The first amendment is related to Division 2 of Schedule 3 of Companies Act. Means with this amendment there will be some changes in the format and the disclosure requirement. So of course this format will not affect the entire chapter means wherever you are preparing the balance sheet that will be of course affected by this amendment understood correct now and of course I will say this amendment will affect two chapters one is India's 116 because there is some changes in the balance sheet format where now lease liability will be shown on the face of the balance sheet so that you need to understand correct now so that will affect India's 116 chapter of course about the presentation of item and second it will also affect one of the important chapter that is analysis of finances statement where where institute will give you incorrect balance sheet and you need to correct it as per the requirement of division 2 of schedule 3 of companies act so of course this amendment will be very much important for that chapter correct but i will say don't worry about this amendment because this amendment whatever has come out you can read additionally and then incorporate wherever required understood yes sir the second amendment is related to one of the chapter. There, there was one chapter framework for the preparation and presentation for financial statement as per India's. Now that chapter is totally changed and now institute has come out with revised conceptual framework for financial reporting under IND accounting standard. So this chapter is totally changed means whatever you, are, whatever you have done in your classes that chapter will be now redundant. And now you need to incorporate this revised conceptual framework for May 2022 and onward exam. But I will say this chapter is totally theoretical chapter which you can understand by your own reading. By your own reading you can understand. Understood? Yes sir. So don't worry about this amendment. Of course we will come out with the amendment video where we will discuss about this all amendment. Don't worry. What I want to say that if you have already taken coaching class. You are not supposed to worry about this amendment. This amendment as this whatever amendment has came that will not affect the other chapters. Understood? Yes, sir. Correct. Now coming to the new additional question issued by institute is given by institute in revised study material. New additional question. So what are the new additional question? Already I have drafted uh, significant changes in revised study material. In revised edition of study material for May 2022 attempt. You can see I have given all the questions which has been added chapter wise. Chapter wise. Correct. So you are not supposed to do any research on that. Already it has been given. What are the changes has been done. You can see chapter number one. Conceptual framework for financial reporting under NDS is totally changed. This full chapter has been changed. Already I have seen it. Then you can see chapter number 2, unit number 1, in day one only one question, question number 9 has been added, which is already covered in RTP November 2021. This is what I want to say, what are the new question which has been added. Most of the question were already covered in RTP and NTP of previous attempt, correct means you can see only in few chapters new question, new means totally new questions has been added. One is in day 8, question number 10, newly added. Uh, I was, this is not a new from my point of view, this is not a new question because this is only a modification in the previous question. So, but I am considering it as a new question because there are some changes in the questions. Yes, sir. Then in day 113, question number 8 is newly added. In day 16, question number 11 is newly added. Then in day 41, question number 4 is newly added. 
then integrated reporting question number 4 a very small question is newly added csr two illustrations are newly added and question number 3 is newly added means apart from all whatever question has been newly added was already covered in the previous rtp and mtp correct now means of course if you have already done previous rtp and mtp so there are only how many newly added question you can see this is 4 5 5 6 7 8 eight new question has been added can as it will take 5 minute to go through this question and if you have not done rtp and mtp so this will hardly take because there are not much new question has been added yes sir correct now and already i have given all the new question in this pdf you can see all the question has been incorporated of course you can download this pdf from the link given in the description of the video means you need to go to my website if you see in my website if you go to where you need to go to my website this is my website you can see in my website there is one download section go to download section and you can see in point number 11 additional question in ICI study matter for May 2022 you can download from here okay so from my website from downward download section you can download this amendment means newly added questions understood yes sir what about amendment video so of course I will come out with an amendment video don't worry correct what I want to say what I want to say that if you have already taken coaching classes if you have already taken the coaching classes correct now so don't panic there are no major changes whatever changes has been made you can do by your own and of course don't worry we will come out with that amendment what I want to say this amendment will not affect the other chapters correct now it will not affect format changes if you understand what are the changes the format you can incorporate by your own understood so don't panic about this particular amendment if you have not taken your coaching classes and if you are planning to take it right now I will see you can continue with the classes whatever amendment means you can continue with the previous recording understood now even the new recording has not come of course we will be coming with a new recording from December onward but if you don't want to waste your time for FR coaching I will say you can start with the coaching classes we, we can start with the classes don't worry about this amendment this amend, amended video will be provided to you additionally and this will not affect the other chapters correct now understood yes sir so from my point of view very i have already said whatever i want to say i hope you have understood whatever i have said and this video will be helpful for you thank you very much for today we'll meet soon take care bye bye love you all become ca as soon as possible bye bye